Rob at the doctor's toy store, and here's the difference between a automatic and a manual sterilizer. Automatic's kind of like turnkey, everything's automatic, right? Well, the manual sterilizer, here's the difference. Manual sterilizer, you open the door, you turn this first knob to fill, you wait for the water to come right up to this level, right here. Once it comes up to this level, you close the door, then you hit sterilize. Put your timer on for 30 minutes from a dead start. You're looking at about 30 minutes from a dead start. Once you're done, and this goes bing, then you come back over here and you have to hit vent. Vent will allow all the pressure to release. You'll see it when the pressure releases, the, all the vent, the, the uh, knobs come down. The door will not allow you to open up until the pressure is all the way out. Okay, at that time, you, you open the door and you let the heat will come out. And if you want, you can put, it, put the heater on another five minutes or eight minutes to dry out the instruments. Now, the, the M9 or M11 is fully automatic. You just hit a button and walk away. What's the difference? Why would someone want a manual? Well, between you and me, these things last. They're made to last. It's like the old cars from the 70s and 80s you can work on. Then the newer ones, which aren't bad, but when they break, you have a computer board. You know what we're talking about there. Eight, nine hundred dollars for a board, twelve hundred for a board. Um, other than that, both of them are good sterilizers. If we're going to go to the Bahamas or if I'm opening up, up a clinic, we're going to get the manual sterilizer simply because they, they last for a heck of a long time and fixing is very, very simple. Um, the only other thing you, well, you'll have, the number one problem for autoclaves is leaking from the front. Both of them have door gaskets. It's this rubber thing right around here. If you have a leak from the front, the autoclave's leaking, simply take out the, take out the door gasket. They pop out. Get some soap, put it under water, and then go around just like this. Stretch it out a little bit, then you simply go back over, you can put the door gasket back in, and your autoclave will run another, another two, three months, a year, year and a half. Could be a week, could be just so bad it's shot. And that's the difference between a manual and automatic sterilizer. Call the doctor's toy store. We've got every autoclave you can imagine. We service what we sell. We have a brand new showroom. We've got eight offices to show you, like Doctor's Toy Store, there's Doctor's, not Doctor's Toy Store, like rooms to go, we got Doctor's offices to go. So if you need anything to know anything about equipment, call 877-DRS-TOYS, call today.